Hey guys, the objective of this video is to try and find the particular solution for this differential equation. So the first thing to know is that we have an e of x over here instead of a 0, so therefore our differential equation is no longer homogeneous, and we have to take extra steps to solve it. We look at this term on the right hand side, e to the power of x, and we're trying to find some general form where we can plug in for our y particular, so since it looks very similar to our first row, a e to the power of beta t, we will try y particular equals to a e to the power of x. We ignore beta because there's no beta in front of our x, there's no constant in front of our x, so our derivative of y particular is also a e to the power of x, and y double derivative equals to a e to the power of x. So these are all the derivatives of each other. So if we substitute this back into our differential equation, we get AE to the power of x minus 4 times AE to the power of x equals to E to the power of x. So taking out the E to the power of x, factoring it out, we get A minus 4A equals E to the power of x. So dividing both sides by e to the power of x, we're left with 1 on the right hand side. So we have a minus 4a equals to 1. So we have negative 3a equals 1. So therefore our a equals to negative 1 third. And our last step is to substitute this back into our y particular. So we have y particular equals to negative 1 third e to the power of x.